Most kids his age can say about 2,600 words. He can say like maybe like all done and high, you know, maybe five words total. Six-year-old Bryson is autistic and nonverbal. While his speech is limited, his mom, Kaylin, wants other kids to realize that's okay. She hopes to do that with her book, Communication is More Than Words. He was bullied because he couldn't speak. Hanalt says it happened while he was playing with other kids at the park. It was hard to see that. It broke my heart. And I could tell just by looking at him, he was really upset. And, um, you know, we had a talk when we got home that, you know, they just don't understand. She tried to find child-friendly books about nonverbal communication to share with his teachers. After struggling to find one, she remembered this quote from Pinterest. If you don't see the book you want on the shelf, then write it yourself. A year later, her book was published, dedicated to her son. Kids don't get that, and if no one teaches them, they're not going to understand. And, you know, they look at him as different, and I think they called him weird at the park that day. Flipping through the pages, it shows different ways people communicate without using their voice. It walks you through, like, AAC devices, which is like the tablet. He's got one over there. Um, PECs, which are picture cards that you can exchange to communicate and sign language and body language. It's geared toward elementary kids with guided questions to help them understand. But really, people of all ages can learn a thing or two. The world would be so boring if everyone looked the same and acted the same, so differences are, should be celebrated and not judged. Morella Porter, Local 12 News. You can always find our stories here on YouTube, but go ahead and tap subscribe. That way you're always in the know.